Okay, welcome to going through and using the Seller Information Center on eBay. When you first log into eBay.com, what you do is you need to go in and as you're looking at it, you have up here in the top, you have My eBay Sell Community Customer Support. Today we're going to be going on through Sell and down into the Seller Information Center. Now when this first comes up, and a lot of people have never been here even though they have eBay accounts and they're doing fairly well selling. There are some excellent tips here and some basics that everyone needs to know. The purpose today is going to be going through some of the getting started information. So, new to selling on eBay, we can either click here for get started or we can click here. If you have questions about accepting payments, shipping basics, tips and tools, get you on the right track. Okay, If you've already been selling on eBay for a while, advance your selling. Okay. So for right now, we're going to click Get Started. This takes us here, How to Sell. So we have Quick Start Guide. We have Videos for Beginners. We have eBay University. Let's click on Quick Start Guide. This comes in, and they're always going to tell you the information as that relates to you as a seller. So right here, no insertion fees for up to 50 listings a month. Now the way eBay works is that when you sell something, they charge you small fees based on when you're selling and when and how much it's sold for. That's how they generate their revenue besides advertising. So they want you to succeed. The more you sell, the more they're able to collect. Okay? So they have some good things. So get ready to sell, list your item, sell and ship. Let's go to get ready to sell. So right now we have step one, get ready to sell. Set up your seller account first. When you register for eBay, there's two accounts you can have, a buyer and a seller's account. All right, Go with a seller's account because you can still buy as well. Also create a PayPal account to be able to accept online monthly payments. Now yes, PayPal and eBay are related. They are separate companies, but they were formed for the same reasons. Now going through before you sell anything you want to find out is it selling are there other people selling like it what can we do so when you choose what to sell something that's easy to ship okay something that you don't mind parting with do a search for similar items you want to look for both currently what's for sale and also what's in completed listings completed listings are auctions that have ended whether they've sold or not that way you know, oh, here's how much they're selling for. And look, everyone that offered free shipping on this product sold. The ones that didn't offer free shipping, oh, they didn't sell. Okay, the difference between getting a sale and not getting a sale, you want to notice those subtle differences. And look right here. Watch a video on researching the marketplace for step-by-step -step instructions. I would highly recommend that. Now, prepare your photos and descriptions. Again, a video on how to make sure you're shooting good looking pictures. One of the classic things that I see happening is people go in and they will take a picture and they will have so many things in the background, you cannot tell what is the item that's actually being sold. Could be as simple as getting a uh, simple colored sheet, whether it's uh, you know a nice color, either a tone or a gray um, or a light color or a black one, putting it up in the corner to where that's all that's on your item. Again, not a huge thing here. Okay? So step two, listing your item. You can go through and list your item. Of course, get your PayPal account on there. You need to select your different shipping options. Okay? Step three, sell and ship. Once it ships, you can actually print your labels online prepaid so that you can just slap them to the box and print them right out not a bad deal whatsoever okay and then of course you always want to leave feedback leave feedback for the buyer and then they can leave feedback for you as a seller we'll get into another video that talks about how important feedback is so as you can see a lot more here so this is going in and learning through the just basics of how to sell on eBay